You can do whatever you want. Okay. So I take an hour running. Of course, so now that we're running, Murphy's Law dictates that I have the overwhelming urge to sneeze. I hate Murphy. He's oh, a bastard. That'd be a great part. Um, so anyway, salutations. It's been a long time. I'm hanging out with Jennifer. I'm using her camera and whatnot to capture my likeness for my own rights. Twenty nine ninety five plus postage and handling. Um, what's been going on with me? Well, me and Teresa broke up. Yeah, yes, yet again. Uh, this time I think it's pretty permanent since I'm no longer living with her, at her, with her. Um, yeah, long story, and I really don't want to get into it. <sighs> yeah, it's very depressing, and I'm still trying to come to terms with it. And of course, I did this stupid lesbian thing. I'm not even sure if it's a lesbian thing. I think it's just a girl thing. Why is it that girls jump into relationships? I don't understand it. I mean... I understand the overwhelming urge and need to be loved. I understand that. But why is it that we have to get this love and acceptance from an outside source? And I'm not saying all women. But why is it that a majority? A decent number. Why can't we find that love in ourselves when we have to relationship hop? Where we can't imagine not being in a relationship. Where, yeah, why does their love of us somehow validate us as individuals. I don't know. So I jumped into another relationship with this girl, and I don't know. You ever run into a person that's so much like you that you're afraid of dating yourself because you know you wouldn't want to date yourself because you know you better than most people know you? Yeah. Try figuring out that one without referring to yourself in the first, second, and third person. Yeah. It's very difficult. At least that's what we think. And Ariana agrees with me. So, yeah. <clears throat> so I'm broken up. So I've been house hopping a lot. And I'm running. I know I'm running. I don't know from what, though. I don't know. I try to fill my life with things, events, distractions. Modern life. Go shoe shopping. Stop at thrift stores. And I apologize for that. So if I'm doing this and I know that that looks sick, maybe that was a man off of a mind fuck so that she could get me some stuff. See? I hate when my mind works like that. Like if I seem really pathetic, like people will just want to naturally take care of me. Yay. Ooh. Okay, no, that's quite enough of that. And yet, for another undignified moment, brought to you by Ari. <sighs> um, yeah, so I'm feeling a little icky. Um, but like I've been saying, I've been house hopping. I'm running from something, and I don't know what it, what it is I'm running from. It's like I'm trying to fill my life with stuff. And I'm trying to figure out what's absent, what I'm missing. And I don't know. Maybe it's I'm missing an equal, a partner. Someone I can see myself growing with, getting old with, lasting a couple of years with, someone that has some of the same goals, or heck, even lack of goals. But still has enough of their own individuality where I know that I can rely on them, count on them. I want that kind of person. I had that kind of person, but now I don't. Uh, yeah, like I said, don't want to get into it. Which of course makes people automatically say, no, I have to know why, what, where, when, how, and sometimes why. You started with that one. Yes, I know. but. I went from that to A, B, I, or U, and sometimes Y, so I felt I should end once again on Y. That way I could tie in that whole thing. Uh, and this episode of Ariana has been brought to you by the letters P, M, and S. 
Which is another thing. I mean, I know, since we're transgender, you technically can't have PMS. Technically. This is not the menstrual cycle you were looking for. No, okay, we don't have menstrual cycles. I don't bleed, unless I dilated you way too hard. Okay, I bleed. But, but not monthly. Daily. Mm, maybe that's a little TMI. OMG, can I possibly yeah, use no. any more, like, abbreviations? Yes. LOL. I would RO LOL, but that requires me to take the keyboard roll and the yeah, roll on the floor. And if you think that's a snafu, you don't know the half of it. Rock songs. Um, so anyway, yeah, but I have cycles. Or I have times where my hormones go up and up and up, and eventually they have to cycle. A hormone dump, which leads to an imbalance of sorts, which leads to an irregularity. Being more mental than somewhat physical, but I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know a lot of anything. Um, yeah. I'm out of sorts, I'm out of whack, and I'm perfectly flawed. Or flawed perfectly. On a matter of perception and opinion. Wabi-sabi. <sighs> I know lately I've been trying to redefine my life. I spent so much time focusing on SRS and getting it that, you know, I never really focused on any other goals, which is not at all healthy. And maybe that's another part of the flaw of my life, trying to establish new goals. I don't know. And trying not to talk myself out of ones. Someday I'd like to go back to school. Yay. But then I think of all the work, the energy, the time that it would consume. And I mean, as it is, my job I find time consuming, stress consuming, and just back related consuming quite enough. <sighs> yeah. Hey, I? Mm, yes. Freak walk. Uh, mm. yeah. Brains. The other great. See, you thought I was going to go with white meat. But no. Ooh. Mm, that's not terrible. I don't care. This video is to let you all know that I'm alive. It's somewhat a follow-up. And somewhat because my friend said that she'd love to see me make a video when slightly... Mm. Or not just slightly. Don't show me. Mm -hmm. The show brought to you by the letter P. Yeah, I thought it was pot, didn't you? No, I'm smoking tobacco again. Uh, yeah. But anyway, I haven't been getting a lot of sleep lately. I've been feeling lousy. And I have all this stress inside of me, and I just don't know why or what to do with it. Keep it in that deep, dark little place where I used to keep everything. Keep on sending love, everyone. She needs it. We all do. She's trying to be a camera hog. She can make her own videos. No, that's disgusting. Number three Ew. there. I have my scrubs on. Um, but I really don't care once again. Yep. I'm at that point of being sick of you just don't care. So yeah, maybe that's part of it too is I'm congested. But besides from that, I'm still questioning everything. I mean, not about that. I love that. Ooh. Which reminds me, girls. If you guys have any good tips on irrigation down there, or... Sorry. Like I said, not feeling good. Um, yeah. But if you girls have any good tips on irrigation, how often to irrigate... When is the proper time to be using sanitary wipes? Do you use them after every single urination? Do you use them after masturbation? When is the best time? What do you douche with? Do you just go to the store and buy a douche? As long as you guys don't say light salt. Because that's just scary. But that's like those horror stories you used to hear back about in your grandparents' day. Okay, I'm going to have to let you guys go. How do I end this? Like this. Still waiting to end it.